Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to record your screen on any operating system, so Windows, Linux, Mac, whatever. You can get this and record your screen for absolutely free. And the first thing you're going to need to know is how to get OBS. Now, this is free, as I mentioned before, so all you have to do is search OBS, and you can use the buttons here to download it. So if you if you have a Windows computer, press Windows, Mac, press Mac. You probably know how to download things on your computer by now. So I also have a link to that page down in the description below. So if you want to get that, if you want to download OBS, just use that link. It'll take you right to that page. So the second thing I want to mention is that your screen will not look like mine. Uh, the screen in the middle will not be an endless recording screen of, I don't know, just, it'll, that screen in the middle will be completely black, and to change that, you're going to have to go to Sources, right down here, press the plus, and select whatever source you're going to want to use to record. So, the most useful sources that is available to you here is the browser, which will record anything from your browser, so Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, whatever you're using, it will be able to record from that. And display capture is probably the most useful that you're going to be using, and basically it captures anything on your screen. So I can switch tabs, go to whatever tab I want, and it will record. And the final one that you're probably going to be using is game capture. Now, if you want to record Minecraft or Fortnite, whatever game you want to play, Game Capture can capture it. Now, to actually add the source, so if I go to Game Capture, where is it? Right there. And it'll say, Create New. That's what we're going to want to do. Press OK. Then go to Capture Specific Window, unless you want to capture any full screen app application, you can do that. So if I go to specific window, then I can go to the window, and then I can select Minecraft 1.14 Java.exe. That's only showing up there because I already have that tab open at the bottom, as you can see. So if you have a different game, or a different version of Minecraft, whatever you want to record, it should so show up under that tab. Or of course you can just use display capture and it'll capture anything on your computer. Uh, discard. Alright, let me let's see. Okay, there we go. So, in the middle of your screen here, it'll say Mixer. And basically, that's just all of your audio. So, you're going to have Desktop Audio, Desktop Audio 2, and Mic slash AUX. Now, Desktop Audio and Desktop Audio 2 is basically the same thing. Uh, it just captures any of the sounds coming from your computer. Now, the mic is obviously, well, your mic. And you'll see these little bars moving. And that's basically how loud whatever you're using is. So if you're having, like, if it's going into the red, it's probably too loud. But if it's going, like, to here in the green, then it's probably too quiet. And to change the volume of whatever you're trying to record, all you have to do is press the settings, go to Advanced Audio Properties, and right over here you can see all the things we just went over, desktop audio, desktop audio 2, and mic slash AUX. And right next to there, you'll see volume. All you have to do is change the decibel amount, and basically the higher number you put there, the louder it's going to be. So if you put 12 there instead of 6, which I have, it's going to be way louder than, well, 6. So the higher number you have, the louder it's going to be. Now the next thing I want to go over is if you go to settings. Now basically this is where you're going to configure everything how you want to record. There's uh, there's stream over here. Basically you're only going to need that if you're streaming. Which I don't stream so I don't have any experience with this. But basically you can put in your stream key and it'll you'll be able to stream right to YouTube or Twitch or whatever you're using. The next thing is 
output basically this is where you want it to where you want your recording to go to so for you you will be able to edit anything in here I cannot but you can so basically there's your recording path you can just select wherever you want your recordings to go to and the only other thing you're going to want to change is the recording format now I have mine on mp4 uh, it'll automatically record in MOV I'm fairly certain so my computer likes mp4 files better or rather my editor that I use to edit my videos likes mp4 files better so that's what I use but if you want to use a different type of file format then use that and it'll be fine so the next one I want to go over is hotkeys and I don't have hotkeys for anything except start recording and stop recording so basically you can edit that press whatever key you want to start recording or stop recording for and you can just press that key and it'll, it'll start recording or stop recording so that's basically all you're going to need to know about OBS to start recording your screen. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to put them in the comments down below. Uh, remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everyone.